Hi, my name is Aurelia. I'm head of marketing here at London Trade Art. Today I'm going to take you on a tour of Laura Santa Maria's works currently hanging in our office. I hope you enjoy. Laura Santa Maria is a prominent female contemporary artist who used to reside in London but now lives and works in Como, Italy. To start with, here we have two of her works on wood. The one on the right is titled All the Planets Have the Same Sense of Revolution, Planet 8, and the other is titled All the Planets Have the Same Sense of Revolution, Planet 11. As you may have guessed, they are both part of the same series, created in 2017, which was based on research into a planet's surface. To create these stunning pieces, Lara uses natural pigments which she has collected and created herself. For example, in the one on the right, Planet 8, she has used iridescent mother of pearl and other natural pigments, layering them in a way that recalls the surface of the moon, while the bronze shade of Planet 11 sometimes resembles the dancing flame of fire. Laura's fascination with pigments is a result of the research she conducted during the course of her residency at the Museo de Arte Contemporáneo in A Coruña, Spain, where she experimented with how the light reverberates off of natural materials, bringing them to life. Laura is fascinated by the idea of purity when it comes to color. She is very interested in exploring the relationship between color, light, and the public perception of her painting. She believes that the essence of color needs to be in harmony with the soul, so that when she paints, she discovers something about herself, revealing a bit of her own soul. She respects each pigment and admires how they play with the surrounding light and energy. For instance, depending on when we stand in front of these two wooden works, whether it's in broad daylight or in the evening, you get to admire variations in the surfaces of the pigments, discovering new shades of color. It's almost as if you're standing in front of a completely different artwork, surprising you again and again. Moving on, we can see two more works by Laura in a different medium, this time on paper. These are from the same series. The first one, titled Pink, immediately transports us on a sea of clouds straight to the moon's surface, recalling that of Planet 8. You are forced to move your gaze closer in order to discover its very delicate pink pigmentation, giving it its name. This work served as the cover of our exhibition catalog as we wanted to encourage our guests to step into an alternate world. On the adjacent wall, we have green, which looks dark at first glance, but as you inch closer, you are swept away into a rich forest of green. The beauty of both of these works is that every angle allows you to see the work in a different way as the pigments dance on the surface of the paper. What is Laura up to now? She has completed a new residency project, this time working with the metal industry, followed by a solo exhibition in Milan. Thank you for joining me on this office tour today. Stay tuned for upcoming events.